Hi, I'm B. Paul from Elgato, and this is six ways how to use Elgato Prompter. When creating a YouTube video, being able to concisely deliver your message while remaining engaging on camera is extremely important, but can be difficult at times. So rather than worry about speaking off the cuff and risk leaving out crucial details, or maybe you haven't gotten over the speech filler words like uh or ums, or worrying about the lengthy task of memorizing sections of your script, you can use Prompter to help you with your delivery. With Prompter and Camera Hub, you can copy and paste your scripts or even create and edit them right in Camera Hub on the fly, and then play back the script when recording so you can read off every detail of your message without breaking eye contact from your camera. Camera Hub offers a lot of customization options to optimize your script for your particular reading style. You can change text fonts, font size, color, spacings, margins, and more. And what's great is Prompter allows you to change the scroll speed when you're playing it back to match your preferred speaking pace. And for the ultimate control, use Stream Deck to control your prompter as well. Oh, and a little pro tip by the way, you can even make your script transparent so you can see your camera preview so you can ensure you're always in frame while recording your videos. When you live stream, you want to create as engaging of an experience for your chat as possible. And what better way to connect with your chat than doing so face to face? Well, with Prompter, you can display your chat over your camera so you can keep up with chat while maintaining eye contact. And don't worry, Camera Hub supports better Twitch TV and Franker Z so you won't miss out on any of the dank memes with Prompter. One of the great things about Prompter is any app can be dragged onto its display, which opens up a lot more possibilities for uses. For example, if you find yourself video conferencing a lot, you can drag your Zoom, Teams, Discord, etc. onto Prompter, enabling you to bring a whole new meaning to face-to-face -to -face meetings by keeping eye contact on your next call. Let's say you're in a video call and you're giving a big presentation to your colleagues and your bosses. When presenting or recording a PowerPoint, you can display it on Prompter so you can present and keep eye contact as you move from slide to slide. You can even use presenter mode for this window. So not only can you read whatever bullet points you have on your slide to keep you on topic, but you can have additional notes written on the side as well. You'll be sure to impress your bosses with your perfectly delivered presentation and public speaking skills thanks to Prompter. Are you in a video call meeting that could have been an email? Is seeing the latest TPS report presentation not quite as important as how your home team is doing in the playoffs? When you have Prompter, you don't have to choose. You can drag the stream of any movie, TV, live game, or more onto Prompter. So you can look completely engaged in your meeting when really you're just watching the game. Just keep the celebration to a minimum or your boss might notice. Do you host community nights with your community on Discord and want to bring some fun karaoke to the table? Drag your favorite karaoke banger onto Prompter and remember every lyric you belt out while your community feels like you're singing directly to them. You can even do this while live streaming on sites like Twitch. Just make sure you're singing royalty free bangers, otherwise you might get hit with the DMCA ban hammer. And that is six ways to use Elgato Prompter. Do you use your prompter in a way that we didn't cover? Let us know in the comment section down below. And don't forget to hit that like button and get subscribed to stay up to date on the latest Elgato news. Once again, I'm B. Paul from Elgato, and until our next video, good luck and have fun.